Go on, go on, go, go on, Sergio. Go on, go on. Yes, yes, Sergio. Mental. Drink it in, love. Drink it in. Can you believe that, love? The drama. Oof. Of course I can believe it, Tony. That is the 10,000th time you have made me watch the end of the 2011-2012 season. All right, spark this up, misery guts. You need to start trying to get a bit more joy out of life, love it. I am a robot, Tony. I can't feel joy. Yeah. <coughs> Hello there. Hello, Mrs. Kippelier. Is that Battersby's independent blade runners? Burnage Branch? <coughs> what? <coughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Yes, it is. Have you got a problem with a rogue android, Mrs. Nipple? Oh, it's Kipple. Yes, I saw you advert in the corner shop window. Tony, what are you doing? You're not supposed to be working. Shut up, love it. I'm just doing a bit off the books. I'm short on credits. But you're not licensed to retire droids anymore. You know, after the incident. Incident? Licensed? Shush! For fuck's sake! No, not you, Mrs. Kipple. Uh, have me own rogue robot that I'll be retiring any minute now if it doesn't shut the fuck up. Bloody robots. Yeah, tell me about it. Now, I can help you, Mrs. K. Oh, yes, you see, I have an issue with my robot vacuum cleaner. I came down this morning and the floor was just so filthy. Could just be blocked. Could be, but my husband is usually sat in his chair by the telly. But he were gone. No sign of him. Gone? No sign of him, you say? Vanished into thin air? Like he never existed? That does sound mysterious, Mrs K. Exactly. All that's left is his favourite lead cob piece. He never went anywhere without it. Curiouser and curiouser. Now, if you want my professional opinion, Mrs Kipple. Please. I would say that your husband has been brutally killed and mutilated by your crazed robot Hoover. Tony, you are jumping too. I bet you any money it's an old Dyson 360 from the 2020s. Yes, how did you know? Oh, I've had my runnings with them before. Vicious serial killers. The Arab shipment of household appliances. Oh, oh, oh. Don't fret, Mrs K. Stand on your settee so it can't get at you. And I'll be right over when my laser tube is charged. Oh, laser tube? Oh, thank God you're here. Oh, don't worry, Mrs. Kipple. Safe hands here. I'll soon have that murdering bastard retired. Where is the little psycho? It may just be blocked. Of course it's blocked, love it. With Mr. Kipple's entrails and teeth and blood and brains and, you know, what not. Oh, burn it. Oh, burn it. <laughs> it's low on power. Why don't we wait till it shuts down? I'm a bounty hunter, love it. And that there is my prey. Don't fall for that old low power trick. It's a fucking trap. Now stand back. Come on! This isn't going well, Tony. This is a tough one for sure, love it. It nearly had me there. I'm going to have to use my laser tube. Oh, laser tube? Oh, my beautiful home. Look at it. It's ruined. Good job my husband is dead. He loved that telly. Oh, don't... F ah! oh, sorry, Miss Skipple. That looks nasty. Should I call a doctor, Tony? Yeah, she'll walk it off soon enough. Mabel? Mabel? I'm home. You were blocked, so I just nipped out to... What the fuck? My analysis of this situation tells me that Mr. Kipple is a witness, Tony, and so logically you should kill him, but that it would be better... Good advice, love it. Better to apologise and offer a full refund. No refunds or returns, love it. You know that. Yes, Tony. Now let's get the fuck out of here before anyone else sees us. Mabel, 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 Mabel,